Welcome back. So now what we need to do is that we need to work on the design of the user interface because the design looks terrible and we need to make this look amazing. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to head on over to the project and then in the project here in the index that, that uh, HTML, I'm going to add here in the head, I'm going to add style. I'm going to say style and then inside that style I'm going to add some design. First I'm going to change the body. So I'm going to say body and then I'm going to change the body color, background color, I'm going to say background color and then I'm going to use this color F E C 656 and then I'm going to change also the color of the text the entire color of the uh, entire Q user interface uh, text 5 E 2 D 8 C which is a kind of a uh, blue dark blue color and then font size 20 px next i'm going to add designs to the input so we have these inputs we have this input and we have this input so for the input what i'm going to do is that i'm going to say input and then i'm going to add the following for the input i'm going to add padding i'm going to say padding I'm going to say padding, so the padding is going to be 5px, just 5px. And then I'm going to give it border, I'm going to say border. So the border is going to be 2px, solid, solid, f3, c2, cb. And then I'm going to change the border radius. So the border radius is going to be 10px, which is going to change the edges of the input. Next, I'm going to work on the form um, element. I'm going to create a I'm going to create uh, a class for this dev, for these devs, these devs that contain the uh, the in, the inputs. So I'm going to create a class here called font uh, form element. I'm going to say form dot and then form element and then I'm gonna give this form element a margin of 20 px I'm gonna say margin 20 px next I'm gonna create a class for the form button so for this button for this button I'm gonna create a class I'm gonna say here dot and then form button and then for this form button, I'm going to change the background color. I'm going to say background color, and that background color is going to be 5E to the 8C. And then I'm going to change also the border. So the border, border, so the border is going to be R, is going to have this color RGB, 7, 8, 7, 9. 33 and I'm gonna change a few things such as the color so the color of the text is gonna be this color F3C 2CB next I'm gonna change the border radius so the border radius border radius is gonna be uh, just 10px And I'm going to change the padding. I'm going to add some padding. I'm going to say padding, um, uh, padding of 10 px. Finally, I'm going to change the font weight and font family. So for the font family, I'm going to uh, I'm going to use this. You can change. You can select any any font family you want. This is uh, this depends upon how you want your your um, uh, user interface to look like. So here it's going to be bold to the font weight. The last thing that I'm going to work on is the title, this title, this title. So for this title, I'm going to create a class dot title. And then I'm going to change the uh, margin, margin. The margin is going to be 10 px auto. Next, I'm going to change the padding. So the padding is going to be 10px as well and the text align is going to be centered because I want text align center because I want to center this text. I want to center this text. 
Next, I'm going to change the background color and the uh, border radius. So for the background color, I'm going to say I'm going to change the background color to white. And for the border, I'm going to say border um, radius, border radius, thin px as well. Finally, I'm going to change the width. So the width is going to be 50%. So what this means, 50% means that the width of this is just going to take 50% of the complete screen width. Now we need to add these these, uh, these classes to the inputs, to the uh, HTML tags. So for this title, for this title, I'm going to say here, class is equal to title for this dev. And then for the, um, for the um, for the the dev here, this dev, for this uh, for this dev, actually this dev, this dev. So for this dev, I'm gonna change the um, I'm gonna add the class. I'm gonna say class, and the class is gonna be just form uh, form element. I'm gonna say form form element. Next, I'm gonna add the form element to the to this class is equal to form element and for the button for the button for this button uh, I'm gonna add also a, a I'm gonna add the for the form button so for this input I'm gonna say class and then form button and we are good to go so let me save everything I'm gonna click on file and then save all and let me head on over to the browser and refresh now if I refresh as you can see this is how it's gonna look like but we need to center this to center this we need to we need to create a class here another class I'm gonna create here a class and then I'm gonna say form form um, uh, panel and here I'm gonna say dot dot form panel so for the form panel, I'm going to give it. I'm going to give it the following design. I'm going to say text, align, center, and margin 10 px. 10 px. Next, I'm going to add. Finally, I'm going to add this class to this div. I'm going to say class is equal to form panel. Form panel. Let me save and let me head on over to the browser and refresh. And as you can see, this is how it's going to look like. It looks outstanding. Now we have this title and we have this input, which is going to allow you to type the recipient phone number and here the message and this button will send the message to the recipient.